Welcome back to the Famous Room channel. Planning a wedding comes with a lot of stress, from seating charts to obligation invites to finding the perfect dress. What if your fiancé lives in another country? Well, that would definitely bring some more tension and difficulty to the situation. This is exactly what happens on the popular reality show 90 Day Fiancé, where someone is given a 90 Day K-1 visa and the deal is that they have to get married or go back home. As fans of the show know, it's much more complicated than that, as the engaged couples deal with what their families think and how they fit into each other's lives. One couple who has gotten a lot of attention is Mark and Nikki. Many couples have gotten divorced, but what about these two? Keep watching to find out everything that is to know about the current state of Nikki and Mark's relationship. 10. As of 2020, people think they are still married. People think that Mark and Nikki are still married. This seems to be the most up-to-date information as of this year. We can understand why fans of the show are curious, as there are many reasons why we would think that they have split up, which we'll definitely get into. 9. Nikki last posted on social media in 2013. According to In Touch Weekly, Nikki last posted on social media in 2013. This is in stark contrast to many other reality stars and even people who have appeared on the show. There aren't a lot of photos of her online, let alone of her and Mark, and no recent pictures that show us what she's up to. This makes the reality stars seem very mysterious, that's for sure. We're so used to staying in touch with celebs through their social media channels that this is something different. 8. Fans don't think Mark is a very nice partner. We're not sure how real 90 Day Fiancé is, but one thing is for sure, fans say that Mark isn't a very nice partner for Nikki. According to In Touch Weekly, this is something that viewers have commented on, as he has seemed mean and even like he wants to be in charge of her. It has definitely been tough to watch. 7. There is no Maryland divorce filing for the couple. There is one main reason why people think that these two are still married. There is no record of them getting divorced in Maryland. As Starcasm explains, I will add that there is no divorce filing for Mark and Nikki in the state of Maryland, which I feel is a stronger indication that they are at least still legally married. 6. The couple sued TLC because they didn't like how they appeared on the show. According to Starcasm, Mark and Nikki sued TLC because they didn't like how they were portrayed on the show. It's not surprising that people would be upset that they didn't look super good when appearing on a reality show, as these shows go for the conflict and drama, but at the same time you must know what you're getting into, right? 5. They didn't go on any follow-up shows, unlike other couples. Mark and Nikki haven't gone on any follow-up shows. Part of the fun of watching 90 Day Fiancé is wondering who is going to appear on these specials, as fans are eager to see what the couples are up to today and how their marriages have been going. We guess that since they didn't feel they had the best experience on the original series, they would have said no to anything else. It's too bad, as we would have enjoyed seeing them talk about their life today. 4. Fans are very upset about the big age gap. Some couples on the show have an age difference between them, and according to Cheat Sheet, fans are very upset about the gap between Nikki and Mark. There is actually 39 years between them as she was 19 on the show. It's very hard to get over the years between them. While it can be tough to date someone 5 or 10 years older, we can't imagine almost 40 years. 3. A fan shared that they saw Mark and Nikki at Walmart in 2018. A fan shared that they saw Mark and Nikki at Walmart back in 2018, making people think that they have remained together. As someone posted in a Reddit thread discussing the controversial couple, they are still together, someone spotted them in Walmart a couple months ago. We wonder if other fans of the show have seen them around. 2. Mark reviewed a restaurant in March 2017, mentioning his wife. People also think that these two are still married because Mark reviewed a restaurant in 2017 and mentioned his wife. As In Touch Weekly explains, the most recent online activity recorded was from a review Mark left in March for a Japanese restaurant in Hawaii. He wrote, My wife and I would get on a plane and fly to Hawaii just to visit this place. Unbelievably awesome in every way. Hope to return soon. 1. People wonder if they'll stay together even though he doesn't want more kids. According to Nicky Swift, people wonder if these two will stay together because he has said that he doesn't want kids. 
Having the talk about whether to have children is always a very serious thing, but if you're a lot younger than your partner, it could be an even tougher discussion since you could be on a totally different wavelength. We're curious to see if the kid decision will become a problem for this couple, and we'll keep watching for any more news of their marriage. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.